of town where everybody knows each other. So when a shooting erupted in the usually quiet community of Gwenda, you'd be hard pressed to find anyone who didn't know Wyatt Klein, the guy who bought the corner store two years ago. It was good because when they closed it down, they sold it and he reopened it. And it's basically the only thing here besides the casino. <laughs> It was Tuesday night when deputies were called out for shots fired at Gwenda's corner store following some kind of confrontation. Investigators say Klein shot a man twice, hitting him in the stomach and arm. He was airlifted to a hospital where he was in stable condition. Wyatt Klein was not arrested following the shooting, and while the case is still under investigation, the sheriff's department said this was likely a case of self-defense where an assault occurred inside the store. Store workers say Klein hasn't been back to work since the shooting. Fox 40 went to his woodland home, but no one was there. He just, he's a nice guy, you know, as far as all that goes. I've seen him, he's pretty calm, everything. It's a sentiment echoed by everyone Fox 40 contacted on Thursday in and around town. What I see, he's a laid back kind of guy, you know. I've known him for a few years and he's, he's a good guy. Klein retired as a battalion chief from the Woodland Fire Department 10 years ago after climbing the ranks in a span of nearly 40 years. His work as a first responder has been recognized by the American Red Cross. He's also been given an award by the Cape Valley community for his work after reopening the corner store. He's been a good person ever since. I've known him for a long time and it's just... He's a good guy. Everything he does is turns good. I've never, never seen him get aggressive with nobody. <laughs> And among those people around town, many of them are just hoping that as he remains off from work that they hope he's doing well.